Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Kayla. Thanks for stopping by. And today's video is actually the second video in a mini series where I'm sharing three recipes that you can serve for the Christmas holidays. Now, the first video in this series was for my paleo friendly sweet potato breakfast casserole. If you haven't tried it yet or if you haven't seen it, I will link it for you in the description box below. It's definitely a must try. But today is all about my paleo eggnog. Now, of course, it's dairy free, gluten free, grain free, paleo friendly, and even has a low carb option. Now one of my favorite things to do for Christmas is to sit down with a glass of eggnog and just watch some old Christmas classics with my boyfriend. Oh, it's the best. That's why I have my pajamas on right now because that's actually what I'm getting ready to do after I finish filming this. But anyway, what is one of your favorite Christmas traditions? Comment below and let me know. All right, without further ado, let's jump right in and I'll show you how to make it. We're going to begin by adding full fat coconut milk to a saucepan over medium heat. I'm also gonna add in some vanilla extract, cinnamon, nutmeg, and a dash of allspice. Give that a good mix until it's fully combined. And now we're gonna bring it to a light boil and continue to whisk as it's heating to avoid burning. And as soon as it reaches a light boil, go ahead and remove the saucepan from the stovetop and set it aside. Next, we're gonna add our egg yolks to a large bowl and whisk until they are fully combined. And by the way, I highly recommend using organic pasture-raised eggs for this since you will be consuming them raw. Then add in some maple syrup and whisk it again. For those on a low-carb diet, I have provided a low-carb alternative over on my blog, so be sure to check that out. Now, we're gonna slowly add the egg mixture to the milk mixture while constantly whisking. And once the consistency is extra smooth, then you're done. At this point, you'll want to refrigerate it for a couple of hours before serving if you like it chilled. And now it's ready to serve. Now personally, I like to add in some homemade coconut cream to make it extra creamy. Sprinkle on a bit of nutmeg and it is time to indulge. All right, it's time for the taste test. Mm. Wow. It is so rich and creamy and full of flavor. Oh my gosh, y'all have to try this one way too good. Well, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up. And of course, if you give this eggnog recipe a try, I would love for you to tag me on Instagram or Facebook. And stay tuned for the last video in this series where I'm going to share my low-carb, keto-friendly gingerbread cookies. And y'all are not ready. Those babies are super delicious. Stay tuned for that, and I will see y'all in the next video. Bye!